Hello everyone, it's me ASMR welcoming you to my new XD design or XD tutorial. Today we'll make a three or four page. One is the home page, another one is the other sliding page. So today uh, I'll make the logo and the customized shape with the pen tool and other steps. Let's start the tutorial. If you are new in my channel, please do subscribe and hit the bell icon. At first, I have to make this logo. I'll make this logo in Illustrator. So open up the Adobe Illustrator. If you have uh, Adobe Illustrator, you can do with that. Or uh, if you don't have the Adobe Illustrator, you can download from the uh, internet. And if you make a search on Google, you can easily get download link over there. So after that, go to the file and taking new options. Normally, I'm taking an artboard which is 2000 pixel and 2000 pixel and giving the name logo and hit the create button. After that, you'll get an artboard and here is line segment tool. If you want to get the line segment tool over here, go to here options, the three dots and check this one. The advanced mode is on and after that long press over there, you'll get another uh, tools appeared and select the polar grid tool select once in artboard and from here i'll give the divider that is zero and other steps that is five and hit the ok button after that press the shift and hold it making it bigger and after that i'll make another copy of this by pressing alter option and shift and just join with the circle the last area in a middle and this last area in a middle circle and make sure that all the circle and lines are properly joined with each other one option will help you out to join it properly go to the view options turn off the snap to pixel and then join those line properly one to other okay that's good and after that select these two things and making it group by pressing ctrl or command g and then here i'll take another rectangle from center to center and drawing rectangle like this select all the things and press shift and m for the shape builders tool i have another video about shape builders tools if you want to get uh, to learn about shape builders tools you can watch that video i'll provide that video link in my video description from here i'll make the f shape from here i'll make this one like this and this i want to make it uh, recognize from others so turning off the stroke giving the recognizing color like this and select once over here control or command y normal mode i was on a outline mode and after that taking this one only and rest of the thing i'll delete turning off the stroke and taking this one by pressing ctrl or command c that means copy and in a xd portion i'll paste over here so i'm taking new uh, artboard or format or pattern or template for the iphone x and taking and ctrl or command v so this one just paste over here press the shift and hold it and making it smaller so from here you can uh, make the fill color change like this okay that's good and now i'll make it more smaller by pressing shift and it will maintain the proportion after that go to the circle and making a circle like that if you want to get the symmetrical circle you have to press the shift and option button at a time and hold it turning off the fill color giving the border color according to this okay and the border thickness that is five or six that's good and making it more smaller and positioning that thing making it group now our logo is ready and then i'll take uh, like a background by the help of the pen tool go to the pen tool so i'm giving this one into here and this one drawing a shape like this it would be like this okay and then turning off the border giving the fill color so this type of color or okay that's good 
and then this one I'll place over here nice okay our uh, home page is almost done and now I'll write down something like uh, sign up or like that so here I'll drawing a button like this turning off the border and placing the fill color and making it round and drawing or writing something like uh, sign up okay and the position will be upper side of the shape making it white like this two things properly aligned and making it group and alignment in the middle and this one is home and now I'll uh, write down something over here which is the search bar or like slogan or other steps or you can make the menu bar over here and search bar upper side so here the simple line drawing line the border will be white and one press the alter option button making it copy and another copy when you are getting the um, the pink color it will indicating that things that is a uh, similar space or same space between two lines or three lines okay fine and I'm making it a little bit stylish like this selecting three things making it group and making the alignment like this but I'll make the alignment one two and three so after making this one I'll make the search bar so this one the upper side now search bar how will be the search bar making the circle like this okay turning off the fill color giving the border color white and the line will be like this so 45 degree line like that the border will be white and placing it with this and selecting these two things making it group after that the time for alignment select these two one making the alignment now I'll make it a little bit bigger press the shift and hold it making it bigger okay fine uh, the alignment will be like this actually like this with the artboard and this one okay one two three so these two thing I'll make group that's fine and after that I'll write down slogan over here though this one is our uh, food apps that's why I'll write down something related with the food and other stuff and in the middle so I'll take the light font and making the font size 14 that's good in a middle alignment nice our home page is ready and after that I'll copy this one actually I'll copy the artboard by pressing alter the option and then I'll uh, place uh, some foods uh, image in this uh, portion and uh, work with that so just deleting this one changing the color according i'll change the color according to the food color so go to the file and import options from here i downloaded those photos from the clean png and importing this one making it smaller and placing over here and the color will be like this or i can choose the color from here i'll make it like this our uh, this color is good nice our another uh, is ready that is the uh, meal or food one okay fine food one and again this one I have to change this one select this sign up uh, button and taking color from here okay fine and now in this uh, window i'll make i'll give three dots over here which indicating more screen is appearing or more screen for swiping 
okay going to the circle making like this turn of the border giving the color like ash and then i'll make copy by pressing option button one two and three so rest of the action button or this button will be like this okay selecting four things and making it group and in a middle for that reason i'll make this one in upper side like this that means you have many screen in a right side making another copy of this one and now i'll change the food for the file and import options from here i'll import the donuts okay and changing the color which is like this actually like this okay and changing this one that's good and now i'll change this one so i have to make this one to this and this one to this and you are getting this type of screen step by step so hope that you learn a lot from this video if you did please thumbs up and share with your friend and if you have any kind of question query or request please do comment on my video comment section until the next video i may say i'm signing out today check out my video description for the resource file and other steps stay safe stay at home bye bye